Welcome back. Let's turn to the other big story today. Taking both the central and Delhi governments today by surprise, Delhi's Lieutenant Governor Najib Jung dramatically announced his resignation. Remember, Jung has been having a running battle with the Chief Minister Arvind Kejriwal. Jung told India today he was moving back to academia and was contemplating teaching at foreign universities but gave no reason for his dramatic decision to step down. He will meet Chief Minister Kejriwal tomorrow. Let me try and get the backstory. Ankit Tyagi, a correspondent who tracks the Aam Aadmi Party, is joining me. Ankit, what are we to understand this sudden resignation by the Lieutenant Governor? Did it, was it voluntary or was he pushed out? Well, uh, Rajdeep, uh, there, there are a lot of speculation as of now as far as uh, why Mr. Jung uh, resigned. In fact, he wrote a letter uh, to the home uh, Union Home Secretary and he asked for a leave. He, in fact, informed him for a leave that he was going on uh, between 25th December to 1st January. This letter was written on 16th. The copy of this letter was sent to the Delhi government on 21st. So the big question is what happened in those six days that he decided to resign. Also, what I'm learning from my sources is that uh, he, there was an attempt that uh, Mr. Jung made yesterday yesterday uh, to reach out to the Prime Minister. He wanted to meet the Prime Minister. That appointment, uh, uh, what uh, the grapevine says, was denied. In the morning, he may uh, uh, he also spoke to a few uh, senior bureaucrats. And then in the morning, uh, he signed a few files till late last night. But in the morning, he asked his secretariat to, uh, to, uh, to cancel all the appointments, did not take any official work, and then suddenly announced his uh, resignation. So we yet don't know whether it is fatigue or fighting with Arvind Kejriwal or any other reason for it. Uh, but there are a lot of, uh, you know, mystery and speculation right. surrounding this. Uh, th uh, th that needs to be clarified in the next few days. So you're saying the speculation still remains whether he was pushed out or whether he decided voluntarily that this was the time to step down and what exactly was the trigger is still uncertain. Interesting, your report that he wanted an appointment with the Prime Minister last night but didn't get it.